Greetings, thank you for joining me today. This is Eddie Set Go, and in this video, we're going to look at the all new updated 2021 Honda CB1000R and the CB1000R Black Edition. So Honda have taken their flagship 1000cc Neo Sports Cafe and given it the once over ready for 2021. Now from a distance, this bike may look identical to the outgoing model, but in fact it isn't. It's only when you get up close do you realise that Honda, in typical Honda fashion, have given this bike a range of over-engineered updates to raise the level of attention to detail, improve the rider experience and raise the overall quality and feel of the bike. First up, let's look at the styling, and Honda are very keen to keep that muscular posture of the CB1000R, but in this edition, they've slimmed it down and made it a little bit leaner, with adjusted radiator shrouds and new airbox covers. I don't know about you, but I felt the outgoing model of the CB1000R looked a bit stocky and a bit square around the radiator area, so this new update for 2021 just makes it look a bit leaner, a bit tidier. Elsewhere, the most noticeable update to this edition is the new headlight. Honda have kept that signature Neo Sports Cafe round front headlight with the orbital LED daytime running light. But for this update for 2021, the headlight is leaning forward slightly at the bottom, giving it a more progressive look. Now, I'm not sure that's an improvement or not. I really liked the headlight on the outgoing model. It was very uh, flat and discreet. This particular update, the headlight's kind of sticking its chin out a little bit. Uh, what do you think? Do you prefer the old headlight or this, this new updated headlight on the CB1000R? What is certain is the level of attention to detail and the finish that Honda have put into that front headlight. I know I'm talking about the headlight, but it's very much the face of the bike. And I've said in previous videos that I do believe this is one of the better looking bikes there is on the market. Also included in this update is a newly redesigned aluminium subframe with a clear finish on it, which really does pop under the light and raise the bar in terms of attention to detail. Another update focuses on the wheels and this 2021 model will get new 7 spoke cast aluminium wheels with that new Y shaped pattern which really does pop on that single sided swing arm. Swing your leg over the CB1000R for 2021 and you'll instantly notice the brand new 5 inch colour TFT dash improving on the LCD dash from the previous model. Coupled with this new tech, riders can now access the Honda smartphone voice control systems, meaning if you have a connected smartphone and a Bluetooth headset in your helmet, you can use your voice to operate calls, change your music, operate the navigation. If any of you have seen the classic film Firefox, starring Clint Eastwood, with the voice controlled weapon systems, this reminds me of that. Very cool. Elsewhere, Honda have updated the 1000cc engine to make it Euro 5 compliant, however power output and riding modes remain the same as the outgoing model. So there you have the headline updates for the new CB1000R for 2021. Next, let's look at the CB1000R Black Edition. Now this new stealthy looking edition will be replacing the outgoing plus model of the CB1000R. Now I think this is a really good idea from Honda because you can easily make a plus model just by adding in the extras on a standard CB1000R, so at least with this new signature edition there is something different about it, this new stealthy looking CB1000R. All blacked out, matte and gloss black finishes across the bike. On top of that you get the fly screen and the quick shifter fitted as standard. And by the way, that quick shifter is a new quick shifter, adjustable to three levels of sensitivity. So there you have a quick overview of the new updated 2021 Honda CB1000R. What do you think of this new bike? I think it looks absolutely stunning. Um, all the aluminium bits popping, the level of attention to detail. Honda have really over-engineered this bike to the nth degree. But is this bike on your radar for next year? Are you looking to get involved in the Neo Sports Cafe scene in 2021? Do you perhaps own the current version CB1000R? Do you think this new bike is worth the upgrade please drop a comment and let me know and of course if you are new to the channel then please make sure to subscribe to see future motorcycle content and pop a thumbs up on the video to support the channel your support is greatly appreciated i've been Eddie set go i hope you ride safe stay safe i'll see you next time